There are two ideas on the minds of Japanese wunderkinds today, robots and women as an object of worship. The result of their fusion is the cute android all you. The latest robot in female form was developed at Osaka University under the direction of Professor Hiroshi Ishiguro. Android All U recently debuted on the channel of the popular Japanese networking platform and broadcasting program Nico Nico Live. Dressed in all black, the TV host appeared on stage with a pretty robot sitting in a large, hemispherical-shaped chair, dressed in a white blouse and yellow skirt, with blue tights on her feet. With a blink of her eyelashes, she opened her mouth in sync with the sound and naturally changed other facial features, thanks to pneumatic servos that are powered by an air compressor behind the stage. Android All U is a fully autonomous talking robot developed for Nico Nico Live, Ishiguro said, noting that the mechanism has about 14 degrees of freedom. The robot has a more compact pneumatic servo system, an improved audio system, movement coordination, and softer body materials compared to previous androids. Aida is the world's first ultra-realistic robot artist. She can draw and color, and is also a performance artist. As a machine with artificial intelligence capabilities, her artist personality is a work of art, as well as her drawings, performances, and collaborative paintings and sculptures. Ida's body has a large number of degrees of freedom and is based on the robothespian technology developed since 2010. It mimics natural human movements, allowing the robot to bend, look around, and smoothly rotate its torso following its head. The only limitation concerns movement. Ida can sit or stand, but not walk. However, the artist does not need it. In order to draw an object, the camera analyzes it and creates a virtual path. This path is entered into the algorithm of the manipulator, which gives the coordinates of the real space. Ida will be able to perform its sketches with the help of a bionic hand and a pencil clamped in it. Facial recognition technology allows Ida to draw pencil portraits of people. To do this, she scans facial features with the help of cameras in her eyes and transfers them to paper with her robotic hand. The Japanese are trying to make androids as indistinguishable from humans as possible. Asuna is one of the first truly humanoid robots that is indistinguishable from a human to the touch. Asuna was built at A-Lab in 2014. The robot poses as a 15-year-old girl born in Tokyo. Her height is 155 centimeters and her weight is 43 kilograms, 94 pounds. The developers tried to copy the person's appearance and movements as much as possible. The material from which Asuna's skin is made is almost indistinguishable from human skin to the touch. The robot was first shown in 2015 during the Wonder Festival. Asuna can blink, nod its head, close its eyes, chew, and display several facial expressions. Japanese robots have long been known for their realism, but what makes Asuna unique is the particular naturalness of her movements. When she closes her eyes and opens her mouth, it looks as if she's about to yawn. One of the correspondents of the event approached the A-Lab company's showcase and mistook Asuna for a real person. As she got closer, she was shocked to realize that the girl was actually an android. Many people at the showcase were also stunned to learn that Asuna was a robot. A Chinese man has created a robotic copy of Scarlett Johansson. Ricky Ma, a 42-year-old designer from Hong Kong, who dreamed of someday creating his own robot with his own hands, has realized his dream. The robot, named ScarJo or Mark I, cost his creator $50,000. 70% of the parts used to assemble the robot were printed on a 3D printer. The robot is programmed to be able to answer some questions. The world-famous Hollywood movie star Scarlett Johansson acted as a prototype. The doppelganger robot is identical in its parameters to the movie star. The height, body proportions, facial features are exactly the same. To create a skeleton enthusiast used a 3D printer, Outside the body is covered with silicone skin. The resulting realistic replica of the actress can move her head, legs, hands, and fingers, is able to imitate human facial expressions, and respond to simple questions or compliments to her address. Ricky Ma does not intend to stop there. Now he is looking for financial support to develop his hobby and create new realistic robots. I knew I had make my dream come true as soon as time allowed. I have fulfilled my wish and will not regret anything in this life, said the inventor. Meet one of the most beautiful robots, Grace, the first nurse robot that can help and empathize. The nurse robot, named Grace, combines the precision of advanced robotics to collect accurate real-time data with the empathy and compassion that traditionally only the human touch can provide. The robot can recognize and respond to the seven human emotions, mirror their facial expressions, and speak fluently English and Korean. 
Grace was developed as a companion for elderly patients in elderly care facilities. Her main function is to alleviate loneliness and improve patients' mental health by interacting with them and providing a variety of uplifting activities such as talk therapy and guided meditation. For example, she can listen to seniors' life stories, record them, and pass them on to others, or help patients connect with their families through digital technology. Grace can also perform basic health checks, such as taking a patient's temperature, pulse, and blood pressure, and transmit that data to a medical worker. Its advanced artificial intelligence systems will also help doctors and nurses make more accurate diagnoses, such as for neurodegenerative diseases. Amira, created by a British company, operates in over 7,000 languages and is currently programmed in English for the event. AI and humanoid robots like Amira aim to collaborate with humans to shape a better world, playing a crucial role in the summit's theme of shaping future governments. Amira, with its strategic partnership, demonstrates advancements in AI, serving purposes such as entertainment and education. Connected to supercloud computers, Amira's quick responses emulate human-like interaction, reflecting the future possibilities of AI. HRP-4C, also known as Meme, is a Japanese humanoid robot that is the embodiment of an average young woman. Created at the Japan National Institute of Science and Technology in collaboration with Kawada Industries and Kokoro, it was first unveiled in 2009. The HRP-4C weighs 43 kilograms, 94 pounds, with batteries, and stands 158 centimeters tall. It was tested as a runway model and as a pop singer. The robot is equipped with a large number of motors that provide walking and arm movement. In addition, it understands human speech and can carry on a conversation on its own. And thanks to micromotors implanted under the skin, face, and neck, HRP-4C can demonstrate various expressions of human feelings. 30 electric motors are responsible for the robot's smooth movement, another 8 control facial expressions. Meme can recognize words addressed to her and interpret surrounding sounds. Its applications include the entertainment industry and industries that also require realistic analogs of the human body. And this robot has been officially recognized as the most beautiful and intelligent android in the world, a robot we've mentioned many times in our videos. Meet Erica. This robot is so unique that it got a starring role in a $70 million movie. Erika was created in 2015 by Japanese scientists Hiroshi Ishiguro and Kohei Ogawa. When creating Erika's appearance, Ishiguro used the appearance of 30 girls that the average person can call beautiful, the scientist said. Therefore, according to Ishiguro, Erika will appeal to anyone. The robot can talk, answer questions, and has advanced facial expressions. As we said earlier, Erika got a role in a movie called B. In the story, a scientist creator of a program to improve human DNA learns of the dangers his invention could lead to. Then he decides to save a woman endowed with artificial intelligence, which is to be played by Erica. Acting a robot was taught using the principles of the acting method. To be more precise, Ogawa and Ishiguro taught the method to Erica's artificial intelligence. It was assumed that Erica would play her first role in a completely different project. In the summer of 2018, the robot was picked up by American History X director Tony Kay for a role in a new movie. The movie was supposed to be a sequel to the 2019 released American Iranian comedy Firstborn, but the producers and Kay dropped the project due to disagreements. Write in the comments which of the robots shown in this video impressed you the most. Subscribe to the Caro Show channel to stay tuned for our upcoming videos and check out our previous episodes. See you next time.